By the way, we I forgot to tell you about the balloon. We had a balloon which was immediately shot down by the Spanish. An observation balloon. Yeah. Now, I was, uh, oh yes, the General Kent said, well, I, no, I forget about that order. We'll get some, sh I'll get some sharpshooters uh, from our forces, which he did. And uh, our sharpshooters shot the Spaniards down, down from the uh, trees. I could see them falling, and some were dead, some were alive, and they ran like the diggers. Well, we, Finally got out of the uh, jungle there, and uh, we went squad by squad over this little river and got in back of the enemy. Me, me time they were rolling, and uh, I remember as we arrived, our little squad arrived there. Uh, Rose, uh, the, uh, Colonel Roosevelt, he said, no, they sh every time we had a set of detail there, they would say, uh, the, the ones that were already at the front would say, would cheer them. And Teddy Roosevelt was right next to us. He says, don't cheer him, man, shoot. <laughs> I remember that. Now we finally get the Spaniards away from the uh, they had a little black house. Got them out of the black house. They ran down that trench, <clears throat> and we were ordered to fire at will. Now this is San Juan Hill, Mr. Taylor. San Juan Hill. Okay. Now it was not a hill. It was just a little slope. At the top of that slope was a black house. They ran, the Spanish raid on the black house. We were there three days and three nights. Occupied those trenches. Didn't have a clothes off. Didn't have much to eat. Oh, by the way, before we left the road, we were ordered to take our uh, clothes and what food we had and put them in a pile. And when we got back, after three days was over, we uh, went back to get our things. After three days, there was a truce. And uh, we went back to get our clothes. And we found the Cubans had ransacked our clothes, taken all our food. And, Anything else we had, blankets, everything. Did the Cuban rebels help the Americans at all? Did no. They, no. I'm sorry to say they didn't, but they couldn't. The poor fellows uh, half starved and in ragged and rags. Now, uh, Mr. Taylor, let me ask you about San Juan Hill for a moment. Yeah. Did the Rough Riders charge up that on horses, as we've been told over the years? No. No. There was a first place. There was no, no hill. And they had no. They were, they were dismounted. Dismounted cavalry. There were no horses there until later, <clears throat> after the battle. Three days, three nights were there. Was the charge up San Juan Hill a slow one? Very slow. Very slow. And how long would you say it took to get up the incline? Oh, I don't know. It wasn't a hill, it was just a slope. Okay. Now, the first, we went over the, the river in squads, our army did, little by little. And the Rough Riders went ahead of, of the 71st? No, yes, they went ahead of us. They went ahead of you? Okay. Alongside us, when we got the... Yes, that's when Teddy Roosevelt yelled to us, Stop shouting, boys, shoot. <laughs> no, he didn't say boys, it's men. Yes. Shoot. Yes. 
which we did. Did he she, carry seven or eight pair of glasses with him, Teddy Roosevelt? Did what? Did, did Teddy Roosevelt have seven or eight pair of eyeglasses? Yes, he did. Yes. He had six pairs, I am told. Did, did he seem to inspire his men a lot, Teddy Roosevelt? Oh, yes. Okay. Three days and three nights there, and then it was tr truce. Then we were moved to the second part of the, the trench. <clears throat> and on the 9th of uh, July, the Spaniards surrendered. <clears throat> 